Hey guys, Matt here and Caitlin. How Hi. you guys doing this morning? So we're out on the trail again and we got another one with us today. Say hi, John. Uh, <laughs> I don't know if it heard you. <laughs> That's fine. But uh, we are out on the trail again, doing some more gear tests, getting some dirt time on some stuff. And uh, the trail we are on today is Whitaker or Gear, stuff like that. <laughs> We're on the Whitaker Greer Equestrian Trail. It, uh, it's a horse riding trail and a hiking trail. And uh, so far, pretty rough. Yeah. It's not one of the better trails we've been on. All right, so John's gonna is join us on this trip as kind of sole cameraman helping us out with some shots that me and Caitlin normally couldn't get but uh you'll see John more well probably won't see John but John will be with me on some upcoming adventures when we do some uh camping and uh he'll be the voice behind the camera at times just so everybody knows right John yeah. <laughs> Holy crap. You can get a photo of our shadows. <laughs> not All right, so sporting a new pack on this outing. This is its, I guess you can say, virgin run it's a shadow light by set shadow light 60 liter by outdoor vitals and it's a new pack they just launched here and uh yeah i'm really really liking the pack so far it's uh made out of that robic material i'll put a little thing at the bottom and it weighs just under two pounds and yeah very comfortable very form-fitting uh yeah, I ain't got no complaints about it whatsoever yet. Got about two miles on it right now. Moderate load. I have some things I normally wouldn't carry in it just for, I don't know, I'm kind of dialing it in for the simple fact that uh, probably in a couple weeks I have a camping trip going on here soon. So probably gonna have to pack in a little bit. All right, I don't know if you guys can hear it. So, one thing I'm noticing about this pack is it's noisy. Not so much the material, but there's a squeak going on in it. Every time I walk, it... now it could be something that's just needs broke in. I'm not quite sure. You hear it? You hear the squeak? No, I only heard it while you were going up that hill. I've noticed it's like. <laughs> 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 so the trail so far is definitely a horse trail. Mm -hmm. There's horse poo poo. Yeah. <laughs> And uh, not the smoothest of trails. There's a lot of roots, a lot of rocks. It's not very flat. Yeah, there's a lot of dips. Yeah, there is. <laughs> the very first part of it, the way we went, was just kind of stupid. <laughs> it was a big, uh, big loop around the edge of a field all the way around up a big hill and around a valley. And it just was kind of dumb, wasn't <laughs> yeah. it? So, and not to mention, them hills sucked. Yeah, they were pretty steep. We have a log coming up. <laughs> yeah, we do. Oh, 
Okay guys, fun fact. So if you've never been underneath a power line, next time you are, if you stop and you listen, you can hear the crackles from the electricity of the lines. We keep coming across these things. We've seen what, 10, 11 of these things now? Yeah. <laughs> and if you are a horseback rider and you know what these are, can explain what they are, hey, comment below, let us know, because we have no idea and we're wondering. It's these things here. So we're wondering, uh, are they for tying your horse up for taking a break or are they, you know, or getting on and off? Uh, comment below, let us know. All right, so we are on our last stretch here. Man, that was a pretty hilly, uh, hilly trail. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Out of a scale of five, what do you rate, Caitlin? Um, three out of five. Yeah, I, I'm saying that too. Probably an awesome trail for horseback riding. I mean, really, probably a phenomenal trail. But as far as for humans, yeah, a good chance you could sprain an ankle or twist an ankle. A lot of that. And I could see it getting pretty muddy. Right now it's, I think we're right below 40. So the ground's still a little morning frozen. So, mm -hmm. but yeah, yeah, I, I agree with that. Three out of five. Yep. And Fun only, trail. Oh, sorry. No, go ahead. It only took about two hours. Yeah, because. Mm -hmm. The All Trails app was saying 5.3, and we're on the last stretcher. We ain't got far at all to get back to the truck. And I mean, it's I can't really like three <laughs> miles. Yeah. So at, now we did the big outer loop of it. There was like interconnecting trails that went back and forth. And we're, we're not going to do that, go back over what we already did and everything. But I'm thinking that's where they get to 5.3. Yeah. So. But yeah, yeah, it was a fun experience. Nice to get out. The weather's beautiful. A little chilly this morning. It was about 30, and it's supposed to get up into the 50s, but we'll be out of here before that even hits. So. Yeah. <laughs> but yeah, we just hit three miles right there. All right, so that wraps it up for this one. Uh, thank you for joining us on this little trip. Probably going to be a shorter, a little bit shorter video. On this one, wasn't a lot of epic stuff to really film on this. Just a good time. Us all three get finally getting out and dialing in our gear. Yeah. <laughs> but uh, like always, guys, like, comment, subscribe. <laughs> Catch you later.